Now, this is not too difficult. I'm gonna do a little bit of maths with you that really proves how sometimes, on the face of it, maths can seem magical, but at the heart of it, it's just logic. So, I want you to think of a number between one and 10. Excuse me, madam. It's super easy. I want you to think of a number between one and 10. Yep. Got it? Okay. Got it. But don't tell me. Mm -hmm. yep. Got it? Yep. Okay. So, I'm gonna play it with you. I'm gonna think of three. Now, multiply that number by nine. In my case, that becomes 27. Now, I want you to multiply that number by nine. Yeah. Okay, so, dust off the times tables. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah got it? Yeah. Yep. And you'll end up with a two digit number. Add up those two digits, individual digits. So, two plus seven in my case is nine. I want yeah. you to add up those two digits. Yeah, I got it. You got it? Yeah. You got it? I'll say add them up, yep. Now, subtract four from that number. So, in my case, nine minus four is five. You got that number in your head? Yeah, yeah. Got it? Yep. Yeah. Yep, yeah. okay. Now, think of a letter that corresponds with this number. If A is one or B is two, C is three. Yep. Ah, okay. Yep, yep. You got it? Yes. So you got your yep. letter? Yep. Now, think of an animal that begins with that letter. A is one, or B is two, C is three, etc. You're thinking of an elephant, aren't you? Oh my god! <laughs> yes! Yes! <laughs> oh, yes! Yes! <laughs> yeah. How did you do that? Because I'm <laughs> Is it an elephant? Oh, stop it. No, you didn't. I totally had an owl. Oh. <laughs> an owl? <laughs> so that might seem magical to you, but in fact, it's all based on logic. When you multiply a number between 1 and 10 by 9, and you add up those two digits, they always add up to 9. And when you subtract 4, you'll always end up with 5 and five will always end up being E as the letter that corresponds to that number. And of course, the first animal that people think of when they think of the letter E is elephant. So it's a mixture between psychology and the logic of maths. But of course, not everyone's psychology is the same. Hang on. Is it an elephant? No. Oh. <laughs> is it an emu? No. Oh. Wait, can I ask what your animal is? A kid, no. A kidna. Oh, uh, it is. Yeah, no, you <laughs> beat the system. Very good. <laughs> yeah. But it, uh, yeah. You multi multiply. It well. was an E, and I got it. It was five E, but I filled it out. An L. Yeah. An L starts with I an O. I have an abstract mind. It's an O. <laughs> an L is an O. Anyway. While numbers generally behave themselves and do what you want, people are a bit more unpredictable. Even so, maths has the answer. <laughs>